I felt like I was lacking something in my life. I was looking for a challenge. You know, I've always loved Formula One and I've always loved competing in various sports like tennis, chess, cycling. Basically, I wanted a challenge and I wanted to see if I have what it takes. Yeah. Oh, fun attack on Cosmic. Goes for the switchback. Go switch back. What a move! <laughs> what a move, Armin! You absolute bloody legend! <laughs> that was I knew, I knew he was doing that. I knew he was doing that when he braked early. Yes! I'm not the youngest, as you know, I'm 28. And yeah, I just wanted to see if I can compete with all those young, talented drivers. Of course, you always want to win, yeah? But to be honest, I just want to be there. I just want to be able to fight. And yeah, that's why I signed up for the Virtual Racing League. The first moment that I have in my memory was uh, Brazil 2020. We got the first podium of the season. We were fighting there with Air Simon, who all of you know is now in tier one. So that was definitely my first very good memory that I had. And it got me hope because the season went really, really bad. I had like nine DNFs or something. And then to finish that season on a high, I really kept my motivation for the next season. Gonna be close here. Um, Too wide. Late move into the second chain. Very amazing. good move. That was incredible from Armin. And he's kept Meanwhile. it into the Lesmos. Meanwhile, if we look oh, at Stan. That was incredible. In 2021, um, my favorite moment would be Canada. Back-to-back uh, -back podiums coming from Spain. I really had to work for this podium. In Spain, I got it gifted somehow by, I think, Luis or some reserve driver. But uh, in Canada, I really had to work for it. Also took a different strategy approach, which worked out in the end. Was even hoping for a little bit more than the podium. But yeah, definitely my favorite moment. I think one of my strongest races of the season. He's waving, he knows what he's done. He's won the Canadian Grand Prix. But our main star, second for Olsen, Funatec. He did it last week, he does it this week. It's P3 for Funatec. Two podiums back to back. What a race for the McLaren driver. Woohoo! Absolutely <laughs> insane. Yes, guys. That was and there's Cosmic touching us there. Almost lost it. And there's Davidos, he spun. So we get another move, we get another position, we're up into P5 now, come on, this is the last sector, can we get a podium here with the penalties? This would be a great result for, for the team and for the championship. So we actually get P3, our third podium of the season. Guys, get in there. I want to thank everyone who made this season so special. Thank you to all the drivers who participated. We almost had a full grade towards the end of the season, which was awesome. Thank you to the commentators, Aiden. I always love checking in on the stream to see what you thought of my bad ERS management. Thank you, Jack, for that. And yeah, to all the organization of the league, just a big thank you. And I can't wait to be back for the next season in tier one. So yeah, I will be a reserve driver now. But anyways, uh, watch this space. Tomorrow I'm gonna finish the last race of the season. And don't worry, guys. I'll be back. If Fanatec wins, I'll eat my shoe. Sorry, yeah. Fanatec. Fanatec! Darkseid, can you let Fanatec win? The Sparko one as well. Oh, Fanatec, please win this. <laughs> Thank you, guys. To whom it may concern. Thank you. Fanatec crosses to get his first podium. <laughs> He's done it! <laughs> Fanatec, yes, he has a podium. <laughs> Away oh from my. all this action, Funatech gets his first podium in VRL. I didn't realise this happened. Holy.